Hey guys, this is a requested video. Now, someone sent this picture to me and requested that I make a mirrored storage side table using cardboard. And I added some little glam to it, and this is what I came up with. And I'd like to share with you guys how I made it. Now, these are the items that I use for this project. of all the items used will be in the description box below. Now we're going to start off by cutting down our trifle board into the measurements that we need. Now I'm going to be gluing down two boards together and I've been asked this question a lot of time about the durability and yes it's possible when you have more cardboard and more glue to achieve something much more durable. I spray printed them silver and now I took a poster board and I cut it down to size and sprayed it silver also and this is what I'm going to be using to cover the box that I'll be using as the inner storage. Now this is just for the door that I'll be using for the project. Now this other part of the poster board is what I'm going to be using to compensate for the extra space and I made two of them. These are heavy duty drawer slides. I've had these slides for like months now and I didn't want to buy another one so I just had to use it. But you can use something that's lighter. So this is how I'm going to be gluing it down to the boards and I did that for both boards. When you're going to be gluing your drawer slides, on the second board, you're going to have to uh, put it at the other side. You're going to turn it over so it starts at the opposite side. I'm going to be securing the slides with these screws. They come with the slides whenever you buy them. Now, I'm going to be using just two screws on each side, but you can use more if you like. Here, I'm just making the frame for uh, the side table using the cardboards that were cut, glued down, and spray painted earlier. This is the side where I'm going to be gluing down the boards that have the drawer slide. So we're going to turn it over, put something at the back to support it, and we're going to glue down the two boards that have the drawer slides on each side. Next thing will be to take the prepped board and glue it at the top, which is going to become the bottom when you flip it over. And the outer frame is ready. Now this is the box I intend to use for the inside. I'm just going to cut it down to the size that would fit into the outer frame. So this is what I have. I'm just going to glue them down and I'm just going to make sure that it's snug. It has to be really snug inside so that the drawer pool or the drawer slide can hold on to it. I cut poster board pieces to size of the box and spray painted them silver so I can have smooth surface all over the box. Now this is what it looks like and we have to make sure that it still fits. Yay! It fits. This is the fabric that I'm going to be using inside the box. Now you can use anything you like. I glued this fabric inside. You can use fabric, you can use paper, but this is what I used. We're going to tilt the box to the side. So we can have enough space for us to use our screws to attach the inner box with the drawer slides. And I used two screws on each side. When I was done, I turned it over and I glued down these napkin rings just to give me more height for my side table. This is the cardboard that I'm going to be gluing down to the inner box to make it easy to pull it in and out. When I was done with that, I went around with my E6000 glue around each and every one of the corners to make sure that the box comes out strong. I'm going to be using Dollar Tree mirrors and I'm simply detaching it from the frame. I used five of them and I used the hot glue gun first and I went around with an E6000 glue for a perfect hold. I already started gluing down my diamond wrap around the whole box, but I want to show you guys that every single corner has to be covered. And I'm going to go through even the corners that are inside the drawer. 
What a lovely turnout! I just love the look of the side table because it has a storage and it's got mirrors. It's like everything in one. I am so happy that I tried out this decor using the picture that was sent to me. And I mean, this is just beautiful. I mean, I'm so happy with the turnout. Let me know in the comment section below what you guys think about this beautiful side table storage and if it's something you'd like to try out. I hope you enjoyed the video and remember to like and share. Thank you so much for watching and I have other videos linked in the description box below. Do check it out and don't forget to click on the subscribe button.